Right-wing political commentator Dave Rubin was on someone else's show and they were having a general discussion, I'm assuming, about Ideas. how horrible the left is. And this particular clip is blowing up on left Twitter because Dave Rubin manages to contradict himself not once but twice in this short 25-second clip. And, you know, putting aside the fact that he contradicted himself and it's stupid, the point overall that he's trying to make is also seemingly idiotic in and of itself. So let's watch and then we'll discuss it uh, afterwards. Name three, uh, if you say to anybody, you could say to the far furthest lefty socialist Bernie Bananas loon on Twitter, if you say to them, name three politicians you like, they can't do it. They'll say Bernie, AOC, and then, you know, maybe pick another. But the point is nobody can pick three they like. Even the people who love Trump the most, they don't love him because he's a politician. They love him because he's not a politician. <laughs> Dave Rubin is, um, he's a very unique individual. We'll say that. Um, the look on that guy's face was listening to him talk and make this completely incoherent point was really, I think, um, it was the cherry on top of this clip. <laughs> you can tell he was just kind of like nodding along, tr along trying to be polite. But, um... Dave Rubin was going nowhere. So, I mean, <laughs> in case, you, you know, you couldn't follow along because it was difficult, right? So, first, he asserts that nobody can name three politicians that they like, and then he proceeds to use the left as an example. Uh, but in his own example, he disproves that original point by basically saying, oh, well, okay, the left can name three politicians. But then, after disproving his own point, he goes back to his original point that nobody can name three politicians that they like. Except you just disproved the original point that you made. So why would you go back to that after disproving your original point? Like, <laughs> let's, let's, let's go through. I, I took the time to transcribe this. Name three. Uh, you could say to anybody, you could say to the far furthest left socialist Bernie Bananas loon on Twitter, if you, if you say name three politicians you like, they can't do it. They'll say Bernie AOC. And maybe pick another. So just easily name, three, easily name three politicians. Um, but the point is nobody can. Pick, but the point is nobody can pick three they like. Even people who love Trump the most. So then he goes. On, so then he goes on to attacking the right. They they don't love him because he, he's a politician. They love him because he's not a politician. Except. I mean, okay, I get that he's not a career politician, but he's been president now for almost four years. So I think that, you know, he can no longer say I'm not a politician because you're a politician. You've been president now. Dave Rubin, it's like I almost feel bad making fun of him because this is the low hanging fruit. Um, <laughs> and like, even though he has a larger audience than me and a bigger platform, like it still feels like I'm punching down by making fun of Dave Rubin. Because he, like, you'd think that he'd be more, like, seasoned here. He's been doing political commentary longer than a lot of us. I mean, he's been doing this longer than me, David Dole. Um, and yet he's still, like, he makes rookie mistakes where he'll, like, he'll just move his mouth and noise will come out. And he's just headed in one direction. He doesn't necessarily know what point he's trying to make, but he just keeps talking and keeps talking and keeps talking. And he hopes he'll arrive at some type of cohesive conclusion. But, you know, along the way, even if he gets to that point, you know, we go on this huge incoherent journey. And it's like, it puts your brain into recovery mode. <laughs> My brain is still in recovery mode from taking in so many high-level important ideas. So, I mean, I don't I don't know what, what's left to say about this clip. Dave Rubin now uh, perhaps broke his own record contradicting himself not once but twice within 25 seconds. Don't even know what the point he was trying to make was. It was stupid, so it wasn't even worth making himself look foolish to make said point. Nonetheless, that's Rabe Dubin. You know, um, love him or hate him, you got to accept him. He uh, is not a serious person ideas. Amazon and drones and blah, blah, blah. That's a male, not a beta male.